So today we have come to a girls school in Worthing to find out what Brighton and Hove Albion Foundation are doing with the Premier League to provide a pathway for girls who want to play the beautiful game. Let's go. What's going to happen is, okay, we're going to get you in with a ball each inside the square once we've got you bibbed up. Obviously, we'll finish with some matches at the end because I all know you love playing games. Okay, everyone happy? Tell me, how long have you been doing sessions here at the school? At Davidson's, they've been a long-term partner of ours um, with the funding that we get from the Premier League. We've been here for seven years now, so a really long-term partnership, and we've seen it grow from strength to strength um, over the course of the last seven years. Tell us a little bit about your role here at Davidson School. So I am part of the P department here. It's a fantastic school to work at and as you can see we have a fantastic facility here which we're really fortunate to have. From when you first put on the session to now, how has that changed? We were at the very beginning maybe getting like 15 to 20 pupils turning up every week. We're getting about 50 pupils coming every week consistently and always new pupils coming in saying can I give it a go because they want to get involved whether it's their first time or whether they play outside of school. How important is it that there's a pathway in place for girls? Yeah, it's great. I think obviously for me, growing up, there wasn't situations where there was this many girls who wanted to play football or even having the opportunity to play football. You know, the girls are coming here and they want to be here. They want to be playing and it's not forced on them. It's not forced to come out and play football. They want to be here. It's amazing and hopefully, you know, it continues to grow throughout, you know, the whole country. And what advice then would you give to these girls that are here today? It doesn't matter if you play on different levels, as long as you enjoy it, I would say, that's the most important thing. If you're 12, doesn't matter, or 35, and always keep working hard if you want to achieve your goals, I would say. When I first started coming here, there wasn't many girls playing, but then over the years it's definitely got bigger. Obviously you play football with your friends, and you also get to like play football, which is like, obviously the best bit. But it's like, you actually have quite a lot of fun. Have you spotted Brighton's next storm? No, oh, I have, yeah. have, have to have a, a little look, but it looks like they can all strike a ball very well. Yeah, they're coming for your job. I know, yeah. <laughs> I've only got a few more years, so it's all right. <laughs>